Hello folks, Foxo back again and from my last videos I'm still on this planet um, with extreme storms, reference my storm crystals and I've decided, you see my nose, I'm following my nose again I'm going to uh, make a, a storm base right here because it's a nice, really nice flat area and my nose just told me to build one so that's what I'm going to do and I'm going to show most of it um, I haven't even discovered the system yet. I haven't flown out into the uh, space yet. We've uh, obviously we've got sent by the Atlas to this particular planet. We've got to alert Nada as well to the fate of the Atlas, but we'll do that later. So I've decided to plonk a base down here, which I'm going to show, and also make, find a hot spot. I've already had a look. We found one hot spot um, for mining. I won't show yet. It will in a minute when I do that. And so what I'm going to do. I'm going to put my base unit right next to this. This is where a crystal will come normally. Um, probably not now because I'll probably... Um, oh, here we go. It would happen now, wouldn't it, while I'm recording? Because it's going to make it a bit visually impaired. <laughs> anyway, let's, um, let's put a base down quick. Can we get it started off? No, not one of them. Base, please. Base! Thank you. I'm going to put it near there, so I'm going to actually build over there. I started clearing some of the stuff away here it was all around here, all, a load of stuff was here, but anyway, let's plump it down just here and then claim it. Uh, sorry about the visuals now guys, because we're on a stormy planet it's going to be a bit yicky. Searching car talker, yeah, go, 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 just go through it. Claim base. You need to put a base down first before you can put a power unit from memory. I haven't done it in a while, so it may be a bit scratchy with me. But I'm going to put the um, PowerPoint down first, so let's name the base. Ah, we'll wait for the storm to go. We might actually collect some Urat outpost. It's going to be Storm Base Zebra. Now that reminds me of an old film, isn't it? I think. <laughs> I can't remember exactly about the film. There was a play. Oh, yeah, I can't remember. It. Anyway, Storm Base Zebra. Is the name of this one. It's just for the fact so I can come back if I want to, ever want to find storm crystals again. Um, it's easy, I've got a base where there's definitely some, so um, can we see anymore? I've mined quite a bit, so they don't seem to be regenerating near my base. Look, that one, no? You see, there's not any near my base. Because I've done all the area around here, presumably and they won't respawn. You have to go to a new area. But anyway, this just means flying somewhere else to a, a different location in the planet. But let's, even in this storm, we should be able to find a power hot point. I know there's one here because I've had a look already, guys. Right, so we change our survey mode. No, not to wave. Because <laughs> uh, I've got wave on number one. It's mucking it up, but I put it on number three. So there we go. Nearby hot, no nearby hot site. But if you hit three again, hotspot proximity, deep level mining deposit. Oh wait a minute, what's on here a minute ago? I don't want the deep level mining. Hmm. Where did I find it? I know I found it. Let's uh, let's go over it a bit. If you just move a little way. I know there was one here, I'm saw one here. Oh, this is a hot phosphorus deep level mining. Why isn't it marked up? Because I marked it actually. That's, that's you see, the, the deep level mining is over that way somewhere. It's a uh, level C. Um, but there's also, I know there's a hot spot here somewhere. Well, so here we go. <clears throat> we keep doing that clicking it. It's a B level. Oh, keep going right. Keep going right. It's to the right, and yet it won't. Ah, right, it's over there somewhere. 300. It's not too bad, it's not too far away. So let's just walk that way and make sure it's steady. And then we can come out and then do a quick run and just keep running. Three hundred thirty-one. 
going to be, be outside this flat area anyway. I'll keep it central. 256. And then we'll have to drag a pipe line all the way back to the base. Should be able to do it okay. Hope so. I can't remember to be honest, it's a long time since I've done this. So we get full power to the base. Because I'm going to use cuboid rooms and all that sort of stuff for this particular base. Well, I hope we're not going over that mountain. There we are. Yeah, definitely that's the right place. Then. Keep going. Let's get fresh up. Ninety two is not far away now. <coughs> Storm clearing, cool. <coughs> yeah, it's a bit away from the base. We're getting close. Let's go a bit further. Yeah, it's gonna be over here somewhere. Oh, go to the right. Yeah, it's not giving me the achievement though. I've been quite here quite a long time and my soul level is not going up. So I'm, I think I might be bugged. Unless you've got to be here for five pretty hours. It's getting there. There we go. Now we're um, analysing. Hotspot analyse complete. Local field strength 71%, maximum field strength 17 That's not bad actually, is it? Um, I don't think so anyway, can we plonk it down? Let's have a look. Yes, yeah, we can actually, I think. Can we? Don't say we've got to put another base nearby. Sometimes you have to put another base because at the moment it doesn't look like we can do it. No. <clears throat> so what we have to do, <clears throat> halfway between this point and the base, which is over there, halfway between or we actually plonk a base, another base here because we haven't got the option to do it so that will be two bases together you can do that actually I think I think we're fine enough can we? yeah we can so we need to put a base here so we can join the two together so then we can plonk the hot base down and how am I going to do this? hmm Let's just put it up on there. Let's see what happens. Okay, and out, boy. So that's two bases on one thing. Claim base. Okay. And just name that one. Kayla Power Power Point Location Cool Eventually we'll have to put to get that name to change we're gonna have to probably put a um, portal down here but um, Let's check that PowerPoint again. Oh, come on. Not the mining one. Oh, there it is. That's the electric one. So we just go over here. Put it close to where we found it. No, I want this one. So we can just put it here. Let's see if we can build it first. Yeah, we can. Power industry, power, it's not that one. Here we go, industrial. High capacity, electrical wiring, used wiring, yeah, yeah. Mineral, no, not mineral. Gas, no. What? Where's me power one? We need a slot, but I... Oh, freaking hell, didn't I get one? Oh, no, don't say I haven't got one. Hmm. Let's put a power uh, a supply for 
Yeah, put one of these down here so we can mark it properly. Uh, it looks like I'm going to have to go to the Nexus and get one. Because I can't have it on my system unless it's somewhere else. can't be somewhere else, can it? No, it's not on that menu. Oh, yes, it is. Ah, there it is. Cool. Um, two metal plating. Oh, good. I didn't think I had it. I got it on the wrong menu. There you go, see? Live and learn again. Right, let's make some... Um, we do want a couple, so... Let's just make ten. Right, let's try that again. Um, where was it? I was on... Um, there it is. Okay, so it should power up. One. Let's put two up. Initially I'm just going to put two. We might need more to get the full power of what we would want at, this, at the um, base. I'm not 100% sure. This is going on memory, guys. I haven't looked at how this works again, so I'm not 100% sure. But let's build a storage unit. I know it would need some of that, I think. <laughs> let's have a look. Where was the storage unit? Up there. Supply depot. Um, automatic storage unit connects to a supply grid using pipelines automatically stores the output of various mineral and gas extractors allowing for increased capacity oh so for mineral and gas extractors okay so we don't need to do that yet because i'm not doing that here yet we'll see okay are they actually working let's have a look we've got to join them together haven't we no not one that one yeah it's that one ah! Where's the wiring? Oh, there it is. So we join them two together. I oh, was already on that one. That's it. Join them together. So they're working together. Cool. Let's just double check. Right, it's generating um, power up at 214 kp. That probably won't be enough. But available is 424 kp. Grid power storage, no batteries. You don't need batteries with these. Um, right, we've got them down, so let's just let them generate and get back to our other part of the base. That's why I need that power point. So you need that if it's quite away from your original base. Technically, really, you could, if you wanted to, you could build your base here, but I want it over there. So that's what we're going to do. Oh, look at that. We've got a monolith there as well. In its path. Right, let's start building this base off. Oh, it's 13 minutes in. Um, yeah, let's do a save. Nice and flat, that's why uh, my nose told me to do it, okay? <laughs> um, there's um, some flat. <clears throat> um, let's pick that up and put it down by the base. Oh, wrong one. Come on. No, no. Okay. You know what I Oh, I'm concentrating on the build side and not on my health. Come, you bubblies, because it's you know. Don't get squashed when I put the base down. <clears throat> now I'm going to start start with a circle first. Tower. We'll have a tower in the centre though. This is going to be roughly the centre of the area. Cool. So where are we? No. That lot. That lot. We should have enough. No, let's. Hey, come on fella, get out of the way. Ah, don't want to squash them in the tower. Um, we actually want it a reasonable distance away from that. So let's go over here. Yeah, quite a reasonable distance away. So let's put it there. How many can I make? 41. Okay. <clears throat> we want a two tower to start with. Of 
Come on, on you go. Ah, on you go. Thank you. Okay. Now I'm going to go. Right, let's get rid of some of these. I'd rather farm these and pick it all up than just plonk it down. So now we get some stuff so we have a clear area. It's going to get storm restricted again. And it's just going to be a basic base with a bit of titivation because it's just for the storm crystals really. I just felt like building, so I know you don't have to do this, but I like doing that. I like having a clear area where I put stuff down. So then you don't have any problems with the ground goes all funny. Be picked up anyway. Oh, no, oh yeah. Okay, um, <clears throat> go away, but please go on, run, 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 run. area. <clears throat> I'm just thinking how to do this because this is again I'm following my nose guys. Um, <clears throat> let's go to build mode and go to camera mode see if that makes it any clearer. No it doesn't. But we can move around I've got to watch my health. It's horrible looking at it in the storm. Very difficult obviously to uh, Visualize what you want to do. I don't know yet. I, don't know yet. Hmm. I wonder if this still works. I don't know. It used to. Let's put one of those on. Go on. Well, that's the way it wants to go, is it? Only goes that way. Let's bring it this way. <coughs> now. Cuboid room, how many can we make? 99, is it off the ground? Yeah, it's off the ground, look, slightly. Hmm. I don't think, what I want to do, I don't think it's going to work. Hmm, I'm thinking. Put that on there. Take that off. You see, you used to be able to, but I don't think you can now. <coughs> I want to square around the um, building on this end. So if I put that there and put a door. Oh. You see, let's put the door on the outside so, so we can go in. You see, you used to be able to put a door on there. Right, and put a door on the inside and you could get in. Um, why am I like, oh, because I'm in camera mode. Um, well, I don't think it works now. Let's put a door on this end. <coughs> this is just to see where I test things out. Let's put a door there. And let's walk in. <coughs> now we want a door on our left side. Whoop. There, see? We used to be able to do that. But it looks like you can't. Oh, let's go first person. Right. <coughs> Don't think this probably works anymore. Um, where are we? It'll allow you to put the door in. Oh, wait a minute. It does work. Oh, it does work. I didn't think that would work. I thought they stopped that. Oh, well, that's handy. That makes it so much better because this is what I wanted to do. Have a round square sort of... You'll see what I mean in a minute. Um, Q 
cuboid room. One there. One there. Please go across. Not this one, but the next one. So one there. One there. One there. You see it's joined to the round one? I like making it like this, I really do. And it's, so you get a door to each area. One there. We'll be in 20 minutes, okay. Oh, that's so cool. I hope it's going to work all the way around. Yeah, I know, Betty, I know. Now that, hopefully, should join that door. We're going to have to put a door on the cuboid room side, but you'll see hopefully in a minute. I hope it still works. No, in the inside. No, no. That one. Oh, these. Mm. No, there. One the inside there. Um, I'll put inside. Oh, it's there. Is it there? Don't want to put, end up putting it in the wrong place. Oh. Well, let's do it from the inside. Can we do it from the inside? Should we able to do it from here? Yeah, there we go. So now we can walk around. You see, we're going to walk around the centre. So we've got a central column here. And look, that's where the door should go. Same where the door should go there, if you want it there, to get in at each one. Like this one. Oh, wait, we haven't got a door on the inside. Oh, is it? Is it going to be mucking about? Oh, no, that works. It does work. I didn't think that would work, guys, but it's so nice if it does. Yeah, clonk. Yeah, it does. We can walk in. So it's a walk into the central point, and I'm going to put door on all corners. That one. And we've already got one on that side, yes. Cool. And then that one. So you've got a, a four way into the centre. It's just the way I want it to go. Oh, wait a minute. Is it, oh, it's putting it on the outside first. Let's have a look. There's so many doors. <laughs> so many doors, look. <laughs> It's a door pad. Wait a minute, it wants it there. I'm getting there. There we go. Go there. That's it. Now hopefully. Now I'm going to have to do that from the inside. There we go in that one. And there we go. Oh, no, that one. Cool. Done it. I know we got no power, but that's why the doors are stuck open. Um, but it's worked out. I didn't think it would. I want I wanted to this nice square bottom area. And then the tower goes up to the centre. Cool. 23 minutes, okay. Extreme night temperature Let's see what it looks like in photo mode. Let's have a look see. See what I mean? So you got a join where they um we can all get into the central area and then I'll span it out. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to think a minute and um, in my next video I'll show the, re uh, the finished results so you can see what I'm doing here. It's just going to be a basic base for me but I like poncing around so <clears throat> it will take me a while to work out what I want to do to make it reasonably nice albeit it's not going to be my main base. But yeah, cool. So that still works. I'm so pleased. See, doors all the way through. Anyway, guys, um, back to me. There we go. Let's face the right way. So we've got the building behind us. There we go. <laughs> For the start of my build. Anyway, I will um, show you the final result in the next video. I hope you enjoyed that little tour. And I thank you so much if you got this far with me. And I'll catch you in my next one. So cheerio for now guys.